Hi everyone, this is Love Crafty Girl. Welcome back to my channel. Today we're doing a weekly spread in my happy planner. For this week, I chose a free printable by Organized Potato. Now this printable that I'm gonna show you, I've had for quite some time. I've been going through my stash to try to you know, eliminate some of these older printables so I can print out some new ones. So the printable that I chose is this one right here. I think it's super cute. It's Sailor Moon, pastel colors, and she's like quirky in these pictures. I love it. So continue watching to see how I put this spread together. So as you notice at the bottom of the page, I decided to use this really pretty washi tape of hearts. Um, the reason I thought this was a pretty perfect one to use was because it actually had the same colors that were in the printable. Now they are a little bit brighter than the printable colors, but still had the same color. So that's why I decided to go with this washi tape. Now this washi tape will be used throughout the entire spread. So it'll be at the bottom, at the top, and in the middle of the page. So from here, I'm gonna go ahead and place um, the today stickers um, and also the check off list sticker that goes the same color as the today sticker and then from there I'll place a piece of the washi tape above that now the stickers throughout the pro, um, the spread are the same size as the boxes so from here I'm sort of going to go over a little bit but when I come to this first last row at the top I will overlap with the washi tape um, I'll place the washi tape and then I'm going to overlap it um, the stickers over it and the reason for that's because I didn't feel like cutting the washi tape There was no need for me to cut it nor save it um, the other half for something else I thought it's just easier just to go ahead place the washi tape as you see me doing it here And then from there placing the stickers and then having a little bit of that washi come in between um, The stickers from the first row and the second row now as you notice I am placing some car stock paper into the white boxes because I didn't want to have white boxes I wanted some color and make it look fuller so from here I'm gonna go ahead and do that and then once I'm done with the top and the column I'll do the second page So for the second page, I pretty much do the same thing. The only difference now is I do things a little differently. So like the placement of the cardstock is now going down first and then the stickers. And the reason for that is because on the first page, I noticed that when I did the stickers first, the cardstock overlapped um, the sticker. And then I thought maybe that won't work well with time. And the reason I think of that is because if you do the cardstock first and the stickers go over and like go over the edges of the cardstock, it kind of keeps the cardstock in place in case that glue stick doesn't 
doesn't do well over time. Plus these stickers are a little bit bigger than the size, so it helps to have the cardstock sort of have that extra little adhesive on top of it. So that's the reason I decided to try this a different way. Um, but I'm gonna do it all the way through and then continue working with all the wash at the top and then I'll be done. So here's the final look to put together the weekly spread of Sailor Moon. I think it's so cute. Now I really wanted to use paper as a background for the white boxes. I don't have any Sailor Moon stickers, so I figured maybe having some same color paper background would be perfect to fit in those white boxes, and I think it was a perfect touch. But overall, this was so much fun. It's super cute, and I love it. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.